back, uh, our next guests asked for an emergency guest spot. After begging and pleading. Uh, our very own Julia Koichman and Rachel Floss, everybody. Please welcome them on. Yeah, so uh, why are you guys here? Well, you know how we're having a general interest meeting this week? Oh yeah, the general interest meeting that we're having on Thursday, February 28th at 7.30 p.m. in Humanities Room 2059? Yes, exactly that, Miles. <laughs> well, Rachel and I have been having some concerns about this new hiring situation. Well, I mean, we... Lost a bunch of our writers to that tragic loop crash last month. Rest in peace, Lily Loop. <laughs> and I mean, you saw Quinn's sketch last week. <laughs> <laughs> Julie and I are feeling attacked and uh, actually appalled. Um, what? You're replacing us! Um, no, we're not. What is it? Hmm? Are we not funny enough for you? <laughs> Debatable. <laughs> well, we feel threatened, and we're here to prove that we deserve to be here. You're not getting fired. We have some pitches prepared. Um, okay, but couldn't you have pitched those last week during our- We meeting? have them now! <laughs> Picture it! A character bit where a Moore store employee poops their pants in the Moore store and has to pass it off as the general smell of the Moore store. <laughs> Rachel, did that happen? You work at the Moore store. Or picture this! <laughs> Callie comes on and sings a song about her different UTI. Uh, I mean, wouldn't that be kind of repetitive? Comedy's repetitive! Comes in threes! Ayo! Okay, but did you really poop your pants at the Moore store? Uh, or, what if? I know that this idea wasn't well received in the past. Julia, but we've talked about this. No, 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 no. I've made some edits to my proposal. I don't think I've heard the original. Do not engage. <laughs> or maybe we can have an improvised live sketch where we celebrate the birthday of someone who hasn't had a birthday party since they were 11 years old, and maybe it could be on March 28th, which is a Thursday during a writer's meeting. Rachel, that's your birthday. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> What's Julia's idea? Cheetah Girls 4! We are not what? doing Cheetah Girls 4! <laughs> Cheetah Girls 4. Different spots, same soul. I've never even seen the Cheetah Girls. Which is why we shouldn't do it! I don't come here and try to kill your dreams, Sarah. I thought you didn't want to get fired. Oh! That's a civic word! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> or maybe <laughs> a character bit with a character, maybe we could just call him Soren, who uh, has a secret crush on both the hosts of PLM. Well, I mean, Soren's not, Soren's not even here. Wait, wait, wait. Let's hear it out. <laughs> maybe it could even be a digital sketch where he takes you on a date to the hub. Funny you should say that, Rachel, because in my head, the cast of Cheetah Girls 4 would be Chris Hayes, Smino, and of course, you, Miles. <laughs> Me? And Chris Hayes, who's on the hour before Rachel Maddow on MSNBC? You know, my cousin goes to preschool with his two-year-old. We are not doing Cheetah Girls 4. No one cares about Cheetah Girls 4. Hear them out, Sarah. I, so far, am intrigued. Sarah, I thought PLN was a safe space where we could express our ideas and support each other. And dance Cheetah Girls! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. Come on, Come on. This is the pitch. Right. At five, six, seven, eight, a meter. Cheers. Friends for life. <laughs>